Okay, so me and Mark are out here and we kind of decided that after the shop car's done, uh, which will be kind of shortly soon, mm -hmm. that we probably need to do something over the winter. Because um, we'll be bored. Yeah, keep you guys entertained and keep us entertained because we can't just not do race car stuff. Right. So we uh, kind of came across this deal on Fox Body that we kind of couldn't pass up. So went and picked it up. Um, we'll kind of detail it here in a minute. So it's a pretty clean car. It's a 90 Fox Body, I think. Um, basically, it has a K member. It's got some wheels, has a, came with a fuel cell. Got a pretty good deal on it. Um, and I think the goal is that we're gonna try and run fives for less than five grand in parts. Now there's some stipulations. We do have some used parts. <laughs> <laughs> um, we're gonna try and give them like a fair market value of you know what they cost, but we will be using some used parts, uh, but we're still gonna try and keep around that five grand mark, um, just in parts. The car, car was 2,200, um, and we're gonna put a cage in it, so those we're not counting towards it, but just in parts. Um, you can find a cage roller pretty cheap, so we're gonna keep it with, uh, I think the goal is like a six liter plate kit, intake, Holly Terminator, and see what it does. So mm -hmm. we're gonna and power glide. yeah, and a power glide, and we're gonna keep the 8.8. We're actually gonna take that Fox body over there, um, mm -hmm. take the 8.8 out of that because this has a drum rear, and we're gonna rock that one. Cause that one's disc. Yeah, we need the discs. We don't want no drums. We want to stop at the end of the track. So we're gonna get this thing unloaded and look over it a little more because I loaded it quickly while I was on the trailer or this house and then we're gonna park it for a couple weeks <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it has brakes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we kind of need the trailer uh, this weekend because we're taking a shop car to get wired. So kind of need something to uh, put that in. Oh yeah, it's squirting at the uh, calipers. I'm sure you got that. Yeah, it's a uh, yeah. relatively clean car. Yeah, I mean, paint and stuff. But... Yeah, it's a good bath. It's already got roll-up windows. Which is very key. Manual windows, that's nice. Oh, release the uh, hood. Oh yeah. The hood actually works.
So it's got a K member. I think it's a QA1 K member. Not sure what the motor mounts are. Oh, every guy's head. Uh -huh. nice. Pretty nice hood. Some wiring. It's questionable, but you figure it out. It's there. It's got single adjustable struts up front. Brake lines. Calipers are in the back. Oh yeah, it's already tubed in the front. Mm -hmm. Don't have to do that. I do like one motor plate, just a front plate. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know what mounts. I can't find that as mounts anywhere. They're like a... I thought he said like small walk forward. But I mean, that looks pretty universal. Yeah, I mean, that's just whatever plate you get. We can drill holes or yeah. do whatever. But yeah, relatively clean car. Should uh, should be fun to just do a budget, mm -hmm. budget an build. actual budget build. Not yeah, a, an not actual, a, not a shop car budget build. Yeah, the original post I made for the shop car was uh, this is gonna be a budget to show what you can do. <laughs> well, we went way past that. So this is actually gonna be a budget build. So it'd be fun, something to do this winter while the shop car kind of sits, unless we can find some testing spots for the shop car. Look, we could even have heat. It came with seat too. It did. A really wide seat. 20. Holy God. And it came with a steering column. Motion Raceworks. It's always good when you get Motion Raceworks parts in your uh, car you buy. Mm-hmm. That's just, that. that's stuff we should have taken out of the yeah. trap car. You don't you don't need that. As we say the Yeah. Already got a fuel cell. Calipers for the front. Yep. This would be perfect. Probably do like a 93 in this one and then mm -hmm. like C16 or something in a small tank up front for the nitrous. Yeah. Already has welded uh, torque boxes. So they should hold. Shock mounts. We should just see what the stock ones would do. Yeah. You should. Yeah. They have airbags, I think. Is that what those are? Or is that like a stock thing? In the no spring idea. or what? Yeah. It looks like just a puff or something. Yeah. Can we keep it from anything? I don't know. I've never seen a stock one. I know. <laughs> this is rare. <laughs> Might need an anti roll bar. That wouldn't be too hard with the amount enough of those. Yeah. Maybe go over the welds. <laughs> Slightly. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Pretty clean. Yeah. Maybe we'll even uh so I think I think the plan is, since I'm gonna be driving the shop car, I think Mark's gonna be driving this one. So maybe we'll do like I don't know, sick week or definitely gonna do Rocky Mountain Race Week. I'd like to do sick week. I don't know that this would be done by six weeks. February? Yeah. That's a lot. That'd be pushing it. Yeah. We're already pushing it with the shop cart. Yeah. Working a lot of hours trying to get it done. I mean, granted, this is going to be super simple. All we're going to do is put a 850 on plates in it. And yeah. We already have a six liter semi lined up. So. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So this car over here, I bought a while ago was gonna be used actually I think Samsung was gonna buy it but kind of determined he wasn't going to <laughs> and uh so it's got springs 8.8 eight disc lower control arms upper control arms so this one uh this is gonna go on that car and we'll take the drum setup out so Pretty fun. It'll be a 
be a good time. Just build something simple, which probably won't turn into anything simple because nothing we do is ever simple. So <laughs> yeah, we just happen to do everything. <laughs> yeah, but it'd be fun. It'd be a clean car. So, all right, we're gonna get back to work. Catch you guys later. Bye.